Welcome back to my channel. So before we get started, I just want to say thank you to all of my new subscribers. I have so many new subscribers. You guys are amazing. And my old subbies and my ride or dies, like y'all know I love y'all. Y'all been here with me through it all. <laughs> me coming, going, coming and going. And y'all know I love y'all to death. I love y'all to death. So um, if you are new to my channel, hi, I'm your girl, Eb. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. Um, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and comment down below. I talk to everyone, I respond to everyone, so comment down below, we can have a chit chat, and yeah, so today I am doing a first impressions, um, on this, and it's a collab with my girl Kimmy, if you don't know Kimmy, she's from Kimmy's World 86. So after you watch this video, go and check her out. We are doing a collab using, excuse me, y'all, <laughs> using the sleek um, Christmas set. And this is Bring On The Night. And it comes with an eyeshadow palette, a blush palette, and a highlight palette. And I did show you guys this in a haul as well as her. She showed you in a haul too. And yeah, so like I said, make sure you go and check her out after you watch this video because we are collabing on this. And trying to see what kind of looks we could come up with. So, this is what the cover looks like. This is the packaging. And it just opens up like this. Super pretty. Ooh, <laughs> super pretty. The eyeshadow palette. This is the highlighter. And this is the blush. And the box is cute. And it is magnetic. I thought that, that was super cute. So, yeah, as you can see, my brows is already done. My foundation is done. I set my face, my powder, everything. I just need to contour and eyes, highlight, blush, basically. So, um, if you want to see an updated brow routine video, I will link that up here in the cards. And I usually do my foundation in my videos. So, you can check out one of my other videos where I do a foundation look. So, and I'll link that if you want to see that as well. So let's jump into this right quick. I'm just going to pull them all out. And if you don't know, Sleek is a, um, I believe it's a UK based um, makeup company. But they have their products in the US now. And you can find them at your local Walgreens. <laughs> so go to your Walgreens check them out they have great quality makeup for affordable prices definitely check them out and I'm super excited to try this stuff out so this is what the colors of the palette Oop! it comes with this little brushy thing but y'all know nobody uses those but these are the colors if you can see hopefully my light is not too bright and that is the light <laughs> I mean the mirror I don't want to blind y'all, but these are the colors. They're really pretty. And it's a lot of, most of the colors are really shimmery. I think there's only one matte shade. Actually, no, I'm lying. There are three matte shades, but two of them have glitters in them, and one is just plain matte. And that's this one here is the plain matte color. And I'm thinking that I might have to use a transition color that I already own. So I'll probably just grab a regular transition shade. But I'm focusing on this palette today. So I'm not going to be like showing you those other products. So this is what the highlight palette looks like. And I don't know if y'all can see that. Hold on. Can y'all see those colors? A little bit. Yeah. This is what the highlight palette looks like. Super pretty. Um, I hope it works good on my skin tone. <laughs> and this is the blush palette. <clears throat> and y'all know your girl is obsessed with her blush from Lorac. But these are very pretty and look promising. And I'm pretty sure this is the one I will be using. This is like an orangey shade here. And so is this one. But this one is like orange orange. So I don't think that's going to work for me. But this one is more like a peach orange. So we'll see. But this is what everything looks like. So let's just jump into it. So I'm going to... I need to get something to prime my eyes. And if you see me looking down because I have a mirror here, you yeah, know I'm blind. I am blind like two bats. Like, 
I can't see nothing. Everything is just blurry. It's just blur. I'll just take warm honey from LA Girl the Pro Conceal just to use as a base for my eyes. No, let me use this mirror because, yeah, this is better. I'm just going to put this on my lid. I'm just going to take this brush from BH Cosmetics. Let me turn my light back up a little bit. Oh, <laughs> I'm going to take this brush from BH Cosmetics just to blend out this concealer on my lid. I have been dying to try this palette out. So I said, hell, why not try it out? And Kimmy's gonna try hers out, so we just making it a collab. Like, <laughs> I can't wait to see what she comes up with, like what kind of look she comes up with. I don't even have no clue what I'm gonna do. Like, I don't know. I don't know, I have no idea. I'm just go with the flow. So I wanna set this <clears throat> and I'm gonna use this shade right here that I said is the only matte shade and it's close to my skin tone. So I'm going to use that and a Sonia Kashuk flat packing brush and just to set that concealer on my eye. And I will say the shadows are really soft. They are really, really soft. So that's a plus. And you just want to set your concealer so when you go and blend your colors... They glide on easily. So that's what that's looking like. And that shadow does have a little tint to it, but it's okay. I thought it was closer to my skin tone, but it's really not. But it's pretty. Next, I'm going to just take a regular transition shade that I have and just blend something really quick into the crease. I'm going to take a fluffy brush from Sonia Kashuk. And I'm using a big fluffy brush because I want the transition color to be blown out. Like that. So, I want to take another fluffy brush. And this is my Sigma brush. And this is a clean brush. And I'm just going to make sure I just blend everything well. Alright, so I am not good with a uh, cut crease. <laughs> so, we're going to try it though. We're going to try something. I don't know. I'm going to take the same concealer. And y'all pray for me. Because <laughs> I cannot cut a crease to save my little life. Plus, I have hooded lids. Like, bruh. I'm not going to cut the whole crease, just like half of it. I'm just going to take my finger and just pat it in. Alright, so I cut both crease. Hopefully they look even. I'm just going to take some air spun. Oh, shit. <laughs> look what I did, y'all. Look what I did. Well... On this week's episode of Fools Now, <laughs> I'm going to take some air spun powder and I guess this fluffy little packing brush right here. I can get it out right here. And I'm just going to set this concealer. This turned out good. Oh. Okay. So like I said, I don't know what color to go with. I think I want to use this gold shade. Y'all can't see that, but it's a gold shade right here. And I think I want to use that. I'm going to take a different packing brush. This is from BH Cosmetics. 
And I just want to take that gold shade and pack it on. Okay, you can't even see that. not giving me that gold that I'm looking for if you know what I mean but we'll see I'm gonna keep working with it okay so it's okay I gotta build it up we got that so far <clears throat> and I think I want to take something dark maybe this dark color here is that it yeah this dark color here it's like a plummy purple type color and I want to take that on this fluffy brush and this color is supposed to be matte but it has like that shimmer in it That's nice. I like that. That is pretty. Yeah, I like that. That's pretty. Like that. Same thing to the other side. You just want to make sure you blend these colors in seamlessly. And I think that looks super pretty. So now I want to take this silver shade. And it's just a silver right here. And I want to put that in the tears up. And I want to wet the brush a little. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Ooh. Yes. So far, so good. I'm gonna take the same brush that I just used that silver in, and I'm gonna clean it on my clean switch because I don't have another pencil brush near me. But I want to go back into that same gold shade that I used, <clears throat> excuse me, um, on the lid where I cut the crease, and I'm gonna use that as a brow bone highlight. Oh, we that is pretty. He looking like a superstar. <laughs> looking like a superstar. Looking like a superstar. That is super pretty though. I'm really feeling that. That is nice. This color here. And put it in my lower lash line. And I'm going to use this little small packing brush. And I want to put this on my lower lash line. I wish these colors had names, but they don't. I just wanted to try to use as many colors as I could from this palette. So I'm gonna put this in the beginning.
and on the end I'm gonna take that same purple that I that plummy color that I put in my on the outer end of my eye I'm just gonna connect them like such That is really pretty. So now let's jump into the um blush, right? Ooh. Let's jump into the blush palette. And the brush I'm going to use is my Juvia's Place J123 Tapered Blush Brush. I forgot it's a mirror on this thing. This palette and stuff is so cute. Oh yeah, this blush has like shimmer in it, like a like, kind of like a highlighting blush. Bl brush, blush. <laughs> it reminds me a little bit of Orgasm from Nars. You know how Nars Orgasm has like the shimmer in it. And I'm going to use a little bit of this other peachy color. Y'all can't really see it because the color and my lighting ain't doing it no justice. Yeah, I like that. I might not even really need the highlighter, but I'm going to still use it. So let me contour my face quick. So, the moment I've been waiting for, the highlight. <laughs> um, I hope it looks good. The little brush doesn't want to come out. There it is. It is a plastic, yeah. So, I don't know what to go with. I think the champagne-y colors, yeah, I can't really see it, are going to be too light. So, I'm going to go with the one that looks a little bit more rosy goldish, I guess. And it's this one. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to play with both of them. <laughs> but I'm going to use the, um, what is this, the e.l.f. tapered brush, the small tapered brush to highlight. It looks like this. Really fluffy. And, um, spray my face a little bit. And it has a cream highlight in there too, but that one looks, uh, not my color. And this is just some rose water. So I'm going to take this. I'm actually going to mix both of the shades. There's two colors in here. Ooh. Ooh. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. Y'all see that? That is beautiful. Hello. <laughs> hello. Hello. Can y'all see me? Y'all can't see me. I'm going to make sure y'all see me. This is popping. Yes. Oh, my goodness. This highlight is so pretty. I just thought it was going to be too light for me. I think I OD'd on this side, though. This side look good. This side about OD. So let me just finish um, putting on some mascara. I don't think I'm going to do lashes. I'm going to put on some mascara and some lipstick, and I'll be right back. All right, so I am back. I put on mascara and a little bit of liquid liner. I did not do a wing because ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> so anyway, everything is done. Like, blush everything is done except for lips so y'all remember i bought this lip kit a long time ago from sephora um no need to go into details but i'm just gonna do a nude lip because i know i love a nude and i think i'm gonna use the tarte um rum punch yeah which, which, which i'm trying to see what this is from i don't know it's from one of them tarte um collections but it looks like this 
So I'm just gonna put this on my lips. My lips is dry. I've been so sick, you guys. I've been sick since the new year. I've been sick before the new year. I thought I was getting better and I got sick right again after that. Like, I'm so sick. <laughs> But I'll be alright. <laughs> Gotta get some vitamin C in my body. <laughs> but, so I did that. And like I said, that was the color Rum Punch. And this is Buxom's Gloss in the color Dolly. And I really don't need to use this, but it smells like butter cake. And I want to use it because I'm greedy like that. <laughs> it's so pretty. And this thing make your lips tingle. Ooh, it got like that um the lip plumper thing in there, I think. They don't say it do, but I feel it. Ooh, it's tingling. But it feel good. So yeah, guys, this is the final look. And let me just fix this because I'm over here trying to break. But I love how this look came out. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope y'all enjoy seeing me for the new year, y'all. Hey, I'm gonna try to be consistent. Like, I don't make new year's resolutions, but I'm gonna try to be consistent with filming and recording because y'all know how I get. Like, y'all know how I get. I get in the moods, and I disappear for a while, then I come back like I never left, and y'all be like, child, you was gone forever. Where have you been? So, anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this. Um, if you want to see more looks or more first impressions or anything, let me know in the comments down below. Like I said, don't forget to go and check out Kimmy's video now because she is going to do um, her look using the same palette. It's our collab. So go and check her out, Kimmy's World 86. I will link her channel down below to I sent you, boo. And um, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.